Item number SCP-682 Object Class Keter Special Containment Procedures SCP-682 must be destroyed as soon as possible. At this time, no means available to SCP teams are capable of destroying SCP-682, only able to cause massive physical damage. SCP-682 should be contained within a 5m by 5m by 5m chamber with 25cm reinforced acid-resistant steel plate lining or inside surfaces. The containment chamber should be filled with hydrochloric acid until SCP-682 is submerged and incapacitated. Any attempts of SCP-682 to move, speak, or breach containment should be reacted to quickly and with full force by the circumstances. Personnel are forbidden to speak to SCP-682 for fear of provoking a rage state. All unauthorized personnel attempting to communicate to SCP-682 will be restrained and removed by force. Due to its frequent attempts at containment breach, difficulty of containment and incapacitation, and high threat of Foundation exposure, SCP-682 is to be contained in site redacted. The Foundation will use the best of its resources to maintain all land within 50 kilometers clear of human development. Description SCP-682 is a large, vaguely reptile-like creature of unknown origin. It appears to be extremely intelligent and was observed to engage in complex communication with SCP-079 during the limited time of exposure. SCP-682 appears to have a hatred of all life, which has been expressed in several interviews during containment. See Addendum 682b. SCP-682 has always been observed to have extremely high strength, speed, and reflexes, though exact levels vary with its form. SCP-682's physical body grows and changes very quickly, growing or decreasing in size as it consumes or sheds material. SCP-682 gains energy from anything it ingests, organic or inorganic. Digestion seems to be aided by a set of filtering gills inside of SCP-682's nostrils, which are able to remove usable matter from any liquid solution, enabling it to constantly regenerate from the acid it is contained in. SCP-682's regenerative capabilities and resilience are staggering, and SCP-682 has been seen moving and speaking with its body's 87% destroyed or rotted. In case of containment breach, SCP-682 is to be tracked and recaptured by all available mobile task forces, and no teams with fewer than seven members are clear to engage it. To date, damaged breaches have numbered at 17, while successful breaches have numbered at 6. See Addendum 682-D. Addendum 682-B Portion of recorded transcript of beep. Begin log. Skip to 21 minutes 52 seconds. Uh, now, why did you kill those farmers? If you don't talk now, we'll remove you from this attempt and place you back into. Barton? Uh, speak up. Move the mic up closer. The microphone only has so much gain. Move it closer to it. Don't mess up, man. Look at it. He ain't <laughs> End log. Addendum 682D breaches with SCP-682. First occurrence, beep. Handled by Agent Beep, Agent Beep, Agent Beep, KIA, D-129 KIA, D-027 KIA, D-173 KIA, 
D two zero zero KIA D one ninety three KIA Second occurrence handled by Agent Beep Agent Beep Doctor Beep D one twenty four D one thirty seven KIA D two oh one KIA D two oh two KIA D two oh three KIA Third occurrence Beep handled by Agent Beep M Sergeant Beep Agent Beep Agent Beep KIA D zero one eight KIA D two one one KIA D two one six Fourth occurrence Beep Handled by Agent Beep, Sergeant Beep, Sergeant Beep, Private Beep, Private Beep, Lieutenant Beep, Sergeant Beep, KIA, Colonel Beep, KIA, Private, KIA, Private, KIA, Agent Beep, KIA. Fifth occurrence, Beep, handled by D221, Agent Beep, KIA, Agent Beep, KIA, Agent Beep, KIA. D zero two eight KIA D one 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 KIA D two eight one KIA D two oh nine KIA Sixth occurrence Beep handled by Agent Beep Agent Beep D two nine one MIA Agent Beep KIA Agent Beep KIA D two nine nine KIA D 277 KIA D 278 KIA D 279 KIA Addendum 682E Termination Options Log of Event 682E18 Dr. Beep attempts to use SCP-409 on SCP-682 General Beep, General Beep and Dr. Beep observing O400 Exposure SCP-682 began to tear at the point of contact, causing massive trauma to the area. SCP-682 requests several times to know what it has been exposed to. O-800 Crystallization begins, spreading much slower than normal. 1200 SCP-682 shows signs of extreme pain and begins having seizures. 1300 Crystallization stops at 62% conversion. Crystallized area explodes, causing massive physical trauma to SCP-682. 1400. SCP-682 recovers from exposure despite the loss of limbs and organs. SCP-682 begins regeneration, stating it will attempt to kill and consume all staff involved in Event 682-E18. SCP-682 appears to be now immune to SCP-409. Use of other SCP items to terminate SCP-682 must now first be tested on samples of SCP-682 before full-scale testing. In accordance to Dr. Beep's recommendations, see document 27B-6. Dr. Beep and Dr. Beep have requested permission to attempt the termination of SCP-682 using SCP-689. The request is currently pending approval from the Beep. It has also been suggested by Dr. Gears to use SCP-182 in an attempt to communicate with SCP-682. SCP-182 has expressed reluctance and refuses to enter the containment center of SCP-682 if at all possible. Addendum 682-F Termination Log Experiment Log T98816 OC108682 Cross SCP termination testing for SCP-682 Due to the highly aggressive, adaptive and intelligent nature of SCP-682, termination testing has been ordered with clearance from O5 Command with major concerns raised about possible developed immunities due to the failure of SCP-409 and possible adaptations, all tests must first be carried out on tissue samples taken from SCP-682. This step may be bypassed only by O5 command order.